and welcome to Interior Design. My name is Mrs. Thompson and I'm your instructor for this course. Let me tell you a little bit about myself. Who am I? This is me and my husband, Brendan. We've been married for 22 years. Seems like yesterday. This is my darling cat, Woodrow. She's our newest addition. We have three. Enjoy looking for ways to, to have better self-care and this was my fun excitement for one night. I like making my relationships with students, building them and going to conferences and team uh, competitions with them. These are my pro start kids. And as you can see, my schedule is rather full. I'm very busy. I'm somewhere different every hour. Flexibility is my life. For interior design, the purpose of this course is to give you a various aspect of the interior design industry. I have personal experience in it because I did interior design. My, my degree is actually in interior design and I had my own company for a while and I worked for others as well. So I'm bringing world world experience to you and we'll be practicing a lot of it. It's fun. And then we will be doing asynchronous learning, which is when you're on Google Classroom, you're going to find your, your work for the day and complete it with minimal help from me. I, of course, I'm always there to help you and minimal is just a word. And synchronous is when we're together. We'll be working on projects. I'll be showing you how to use tools and that kind of thing. Here's what our first four weeks should look like according to our administration. And here's what the hybrid teaching model should look like for us as well. This is our bell schedule. I highly recommend you copy it down, you print this slide, you get a copy somewhere because this is going to help you stay on task and be where you need to be. And for this class, I will provide the basics plus the stuff listed for interior design. You're going to get an architect scale, quadrille graph paper, tracing paper, sharpies, uh, pencils, everything that you're going to need to work in my class. You will have it. In order to be successful in here, I suggest that you be on time with a writing utensil and prepared with something to write on. A notebook, another class's worksheet. I'm just joking. Please have a notebook. Um, and here's my contact info. It's the easiest way and the quickest way to get a response from me. Please have it on file. You will need it to turn in assignments and other things. And remember, my last name does not have a P in it, so it will not get to me if you put a P in there. I appreciate your time. I'm looking forward to our fun semester filled with new knowledge and experiences. See you Monday.